Hey guys, what's up? I haven't made a new video in forever. My camera's been broken. I came back from the flea market. I fixed my camera. Got some really good stuff to show you. I got a Neo Geo battle thing for 12 bucks. Some old lady, no one was going up to her. Help her out a little bit, you know? Sealed. Not really sealed. It's resealed, I should say, because the sticker's not there. Alright. And then I actually found this person who had a Super Nintendo. I already have one. It was really beaten up. You shouldn't have seen it before. Completely filthy. I didn't test it out yet, but X there. Took me about an hour to clean. Completely inside and out. It's pretty nice. Came with the controller. One. And hookups. And while I was there, I found Super Nintendo games and an NES game. Now Metroid was just like this. It was covered in freaking dirt. And I the whole car ride I cleaned it up nice. The only thing I couldn't get off is this. And then I got a baseball game for a dollar. I didn't really care. It was a dollar if I need an extra cartridge. Pac-Man for five. Mortal Kombat for five. He wanted uh twenty bucks just for that. And then I asked him for this. He threw in Miss Pac-Man and uh he wanted me to buy this separate but he just threw it all in for thirty five dollars with this and the wires and everything yeah, so after i talked him down a little bit because this was all screwed up and metroid was all bad and so thirty five for all this like i said and then i went inside the store uh... I was talking to the guy nice guy i found his zaxxon or whatever 3d a racing game. That was pretty good. Another baseball game. Had a cartridge. A couple bucks. Alex kid. I was really happy to find this. Eight dollars. Not too bad. And uh he threw in this game for free. I asked him if he had anything else. And uh he gave me this. I spent hundred and one dollars, but I'll show you what the big thing was I had I buy. And then I got this found a two dollars I thought which was really good I really wanted this and I bought it from the guy who had this and then I found this uh, Nintendo game that was unlicensed and this was inside the shop too 32x game for five dollars and uh, yeah so here's some Atari games I got I got four of them I got asteroids I got football Spider-Man and Atlantis for like two dollars a piece but since I bought so much stuff from him he gave me this game for free the store guy the manager said this I have to buy I bought one uh just one of these one Atari games and he gave me these three for free so I saved five six seven eight nine ten eleven eleven dollars and uh, over here I saved like 20 bucks so uh, keep looking and I want to show you guys sorry I'm grabbing the thing my brother got I had to get him for but this so far my brother's playing this concert right now but just guess what it could be FC Mobile 2 it's really really nice 60 bucks which led to uh, 101 dollars and uh, it was pretty good. I'm trying to look for their seat. Yeah, I'll get it. Hold on. I got paid uh, the 15th, so I had uh, 150 bucks to blow. Let's see if I could zoom in on this. So it's like 4.99, 7.99, 4.99. 325, 325, 2.99. 7.99 and 60 bucks for this, which led up to 101, because he gave me these games for free, and that was really good. He was actually looking at this game; he really liked it, because it was so different from the other ones. I wanna talk about this for a minute. Yobo FC, t uh, I was gonna say twin model two's gun. It's nice, but the trigger is really, I don't know, crappy. I should say. Controllers. 
Need batteries for all these things. I forgot to mention. Battery guzzler. Controllers feel nice. I would really like to use these controllers. It's like Super Nintendo. And I got one last thing. 32X game for 5 bucks. Uh, Mortal Cross. I only have a couple 32X games. So, yeah. And, uh, hopefully when I get paid again, on the 30th for my job, I can buy more stuff. So, I basically, not counting this, got, take this away. For all this, doesn't really seem like a lot, but it's quite a little bit, just go shopping for games, looking for nothing and you find a lot. So that was about $90. You no, know, it might be a little bit too much, but f break it down, $5 a game. Steeled PlayStation 2 game, I know. It's a little bit alright, but crazy at the same time. I'm happy to find the Master System games. I could not find them sealed. So, and I found this one for $3.99, picked it up. And like I said, I do not like sports games, but, you know, if you find uh, something for really cheap, like a dollar, you could just switch them out. Looks really good. Like, Mortal Kombat has stuff written. Like, even says five bucks uh, for a dollar. I ripped this one off. This was ten bucks. When I went in the store, <laughs> he had uh, all these priced. He had this for like fifty bucks, which I fifty bucks is a good price for this. But I got for thirty-five, like all the games. So yeah, I'm gonna play these games and have fun with them. Hopefully. So if you guys want any questions or anything on finding some games, I'll give you some hints or something. Always look outside, you know, if there's an outside flea market and if there's a game shop inside because you can find more stuff there than inside for cheaper prices. Alright, see you guys later. Keep hunting for your games. <laughs>